we meanwhile have a valedictorian who uh, I think some teachers and counselors wish she had excluded had been, them had, right, or from had her been speech. Silenced, right. So there's this uh, viral video going around, and it's from uh, San Ysidero High School in San Diego. And Natalie Burr is the valedictorian, and she blasted in this speech her alcoholic teacher and her, quote, unavailable guidance counselor for both of them teaching her valuable lessons during her senior year. Watch some of this. To the teacher who was regularly intoxicated during class this year. Thank you for using yourself as an example to teach students about the dangers of alcoholism. Being escorted by police out of school left a lasting impression. To my counselor, thanks for teaching me to fend for myself. You were always unavailable to my parents and I, despite appointments. Only in these past few weeks, with the award ceremonies and graduation coming up, did you begin making your appearance. I do like how she said in that clip, you know, and she was speaking about her counselor, and she, basically, thank you for letting me fend for myself here in high school. Uh, you were always unavailable to my parents, and I, and I, despite having made appointments, so that's good. But uh, when she talked about the alcoholic teacher, she says, to the teacher that was regularly intoxicated during class this year, thank you for using yourself to teach these students about the dangers of alcoholism. Yeah. The problem with these schools and the problem with progressivism in general is they've decided there's only one way to see everything. These are the same people who are telling us, conservatives, you've got to see the world beyond your biblical reality. You've got to see the world outside of your conservative policies. You've got to get the story about American life outside of Fox News. Okay, fine. But we progressives, we don't have to do that.